first thing you're going to see when you walk into the building, we're going to have our new soda coolers here on the left-hand side. Uh, as we're moving down, it's going to be a lot more room for our soda coolers that we have than last time. Uh, totally, I think we added twice the building size what we have right now, or what we did have in our old store. That was our soda cooler. Then we're going to have our freezer reach-in cooler right here. Uh, over here in the corner, this is going to be our new beer cave for all the beer and liquor and stuff. People can come in here and walk around, grab, get all the good deals that we have to offer. Go over, over to this side in the back area. This is going to be where the new restrooms and storage area is going to be in the back. We're going to have two stalls for each male and female, which is an upgrade for us from our last store. Uh, this is all going to be open space here for people to walk around, get a little, little bit better, better look, more room for us, uh, more room to have stuff in here. As we come around the corner, this is where we're going to be. One of our new additions is going to be our pizza oven. It's our brick oven pizza maker, rotating oven. Uh, we're going to be able to knock out a lot of pizzas with this, give something to the community that we don't really have. No brick oven area pizza is around here. So that's going to be really nice. This is going to be our new open concept kitchen idea that we have. Starting from about that corner all the way over to this side is going to be nothing but kitchen. It's all going to be open concept. You're going to be able to see them making the fish, making the chicken, making the different sandwiches that we make, and then obviously as well making your pizzas that go in the oven. Uh, starting to move over to this way, this is all going to be where our new POS and uh, registers and checkouts are going to be. We are also adding two additional uh, self-checkout lanes, which is going to help us on busy days and Friday nights. Uh, we have about two or three times the space for our cashiers now, which is going to be really nice to have. I know it was a lot really clustered up back there that we had them before. So a lot of the things I've been hearing that people are very excited about, uh, they've been wanting this for a long time. Uh, there's a lot of room we are obviously adding to the to our store, which is one thing we definitely needed, not only for customer's experience, but for our own experience for storage and whatnot. Uh, with the new additions of having the pizza oven, the open concept, it is a lot more inviting, I believe, for people to come in. Uh, it's gonna be a really, has been and is going to be a great uh, experience for us, and we can't wait to bring it, uh, bring it open to Hartford for everybody. Needed more space. Definitely needed more space. We're too small. I wanted a girl or a kitchen, so I had to do it. We tried to re rearrange it in our old store, couldn't get it. So we just had to, we had to add on, make it bigger and better. It's been 30 years, so the building was old and tired. So we had to make, make it new, brand new. It only could be better. I mean, I, it's the only way I can grow my business is by by expanding. And I had to come to compete in, the, in this world. You gotta keep going. If you don't keep, you're not moving forward, you're moving backwards. So this is what I figured I had to do for my kids and future generations and keep it moving. I'd like to say thanks to all my customers understanding and pardon our dust very sickly and thank, thanks to all my employees for putting up with what's going on here. It's been tough for the last couple months, but we got less than one month to go and we'll be open and ready to go and we'll see everybody again.